The Gospel shows clearly that Jesus saw as his main mission this work, to help people see that the Kingdom of God is at hand, is near, available, accessible, present within reach. The time has come, change your attitudes and your points of view, he used to tell people. The Kingdom of God has come near, believe the good news. One day he went to a lonely place to prepare for his next journey, but the people found him anyway and wanted to keep him there. He objected, I must preach the good news of the kingdom of God to the other cities also, for I was sent for this purpose. But has Jesus in his travels reached as far as my heart? My job as a Christian is not exactly to work my projects in the fields of the Lord, but rather to surrender myself to become an instrument so that the kingdom can establish itself in myself and in others. For that I have periodically to go to a lonely place. St. Augustine says he was within and we mistakenly sought him without. It isn't a matter of believing in the inner light, it's a matter of yielding your lives to him. Thomas Kelly clarifies this for us. He was an American Quaker educator at the beginning of the 20th century. In his book, A Testament of Devotion, he says, There is an experience of the eternal, breaking into time, which transforms all life into a miracle of faith and action, unspeakable, profound, and full of glory as an inward experience. It is the root of concern for all creation, the true ground of social endeavor.